Rangers and Tigers, ALCS, game number four from Detroit. Nelson Cruz, the hero of game two with the walk-off grand slam, looking for more. But the teams would have to wait two hours and 13 minutes, thanks to rain, before they finally got things going. Matt Harrison, well, he allows this in the bottom of the third in a scoreless game. It's a two-run double from Miguel Cabrera. Tigers on the board, 2-0. The support to Rick Porcello. Top six now, still 2-0. Ian Kinsler into the left field corner. Delman Young has trouble with it. David Murphy all the way around from first. 2-1 to one Detroit. The next batter after Ian Kinsler steals third. Andrews, the single. Kinsler scores. Game tied at 2-2. Two two. Now two batters later with Michael Young at the dish. Porcello trying to pick off Andrews at first. The ball gets away. Down to second goes Elvis. And of course, wouldn't you know it, Young comes through. This is a single, and it drives home the go-ahead run for the Rangers. Andrews scores. It's a three spot in the sixth. Texas leads it. Three to two down to second goes Young. We'll jump now to the bottom of the seventh. Alexi Agando on for Harrison. Still 3-2. Not anymore. Brandon Inge, the first home run he has hit in this postseason. Ties the game at 3-3. Three and three. The Motown crowd loves it. Now Mike Adams is the next Texas pitcher in the bottom of the eighth. Cabrera moves to third after a Victor Martinez single to right field. Now it's Delman Young at the dish. One and two, and here it comes. Swung on in a high fly ball to short right field. Down the line comes Cruz, the runner tags. Cruz makes the catch. Here comes Cabrera. Here comes the throw. At the plate, he collides with Napoli. He is out at the plate. Cruz guns down Cabrera. And the game is still tied. Heck of a defensive play. K-E-S-N on the call. We'll jump to the ninth. Joaquin Benoit steps off. Cruz picked off between first and second. That ends the frame. Benoit is happy. The next Tiger pitcher in the 11th is Jose Valverde. An intentional walk here to Adrian Beltre with first base open. So Mike Napoli gets a chance to come through. He does exactly that. Floats one into center field. Josh Hamilton slides in safe. The Rangers have a 4-3 lead. The very next pitch, Nelson Cruz. And there's a swing and a high drive by Cruz. Way out to left center field, and that ball is history. It's a three-run homer for Nelly Cruz. He has busted it open again. Once again, KESN on the call. The Rangers now up 7-3, and in the bottom of the 11th, no trouble for Neftali Feliz, Don Kelly, Grounds one to Beltre, makes a nice play. Game over, 7-3 the final in 11. The Rangers take a commanding three games to one lead. How about Cruz? His 10th career postseason home run. It's the second 11th inning home run of the series for him. He becomes the first player in history with two extra inning homers in the same series. Scott Feldman the victory. Harrison a no decision. Five innings, two earned. Every Rangers starter with the exception of Beltre had at least one hit.